Hey everyone, it's Thursday, uh, not Thursday, Monday. It's been a long week, uh, July 12th. And I'm excited to say I'm um, just about done with framing. So we can go in and check out uh, what the new layout looks like. So lots of new wood and some old wood that we saved, thankfully. Uh, it was a smart move because I ended up needing it. So um, just as you come in here on the left, this is gonna be our utility closet. It uh, is going to house the electric boiler, the electric on-demand water heater, and the uh, electric panel. All that stuff is currently in the basement, and we're going to be moving it up um, to the main floor. So we don't have to worry about running a sump pump in the basement anymore. Um, and really, uh, it'll just make everything um, easier to access and service uh, rather than having to cre creep down in the little basement. So the final piece of framing I have to do is... Um, Get this guy covered back up, but I'm not 100% certain how I'm going to do that with the firewall or fire partition yet, so I'm leaving that for now. But you can see here on the left, we've got our big um, opening for the, the pocket door that's going to come and um, be able to slide open to reveal the little half bath that we've put in. And if we come back, you can see where I marked on the floor um, where the when you walk in, the fridge is going to be on the left here with a little um, coffee bar next to it. And then there's the gap. And then this will be the, the kitchen island with the sink, dishwasher, and bar top seating. We're going to put the stove over on the right with some cabinets. I got to play with the spacing and see just um, exactly how big that's going to be. And then you walk out here into the um, living room. And if we shoot back down, I still have two bracing walls up while we're waiting on putting the, the final header in. Um, I needed to dig a hole in the basement and pour that footer yet. But you can see, um, you know, I'm really starting to get a, a feel for the, the space. You come down here, there's just this tiny little hallway, and you walk into the um, bathroom. There's where the other toilet's going to go. There's where the tub's gonna go. We'll put a vanity um, here. We have to move the radiator. And if you come back out, then you can get into both um, bedrooms. So it really is, um, you know, it's, it's tight and it will get more tight as the, as the drywall goes up and everything. Um, but thankfully we're blessed with the high ceilings. So it really should, work out okay um, feeling like a decent decent sized space um, it will be tight but it should be um, a great little rental spot and just allow people to come up and enjoy the beauty of the area without having to spend too much time um, worrying about keeping big house clean or anything like that so you guys probably tell that I'm pretty fried right now um, I just did the big those three full days and framed about I feel like about half this place so I'm glad that it's done and uh, we got the plumber lined up to come in and start running some lines. Still need to find an electrician, but the, sort of the next phase of work now will be moving more towards uh, outdoor stuff, uh, siding, fencing, um, and sort of those other things while we wait for the, the contractors to come in and do the work. All right, we'll see you later.